up it has been a while man good to be back so I'm actually at my dad's property well that he's kind of going to develop soon and he asked me to see how deep one of the ponds are on here so I came here and I was like since I'm gonna be out there anyway on my kayak might as well bring my fishing stuff and maybe we can catch some giants or just some fish I just went and walked checked it out it's literally behind all this brush way more grown over than I thought the ponds way smaller than I thought but that doesn't mean there aren't any fish. So I'm gonna get the kayak and loaded and drag it all the way there and let's do some fishing. And let the journey begin. And it's awesome because I was, oh, dang it. I already gotta lay those down. Take two. So I was expecting this to, you know, have an easy, water access or access my bad and I didn't bring my kayak dolly that's just great oh crap I already lost a rod and a paddle not going through that I'm going the hard way because that looks ridiculous There we go. Let's go over this, get all that stuff down. We're almost there. All right, I took my rods out. Actually, they're probably in the way. Good. I don't even know if this fits. Like, I'm gonna probably have to like go in that way. Be interesting. We're just nope. They're they're not budging. Great, 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 great. Let's see if this will work. Oh, there's. Oh, hey, a spider. <laughs> All right, then. Now, getting out may be just as interesting. All right. Well, I'm pretty sure, like, I'll be, like, the first one to ever throw a lure in here. So, if there are fish, let's just check my knot because... That should be good. I've I've hooked some pretty big fish before, and I didn't check my knot. <laughs> Got one. Dang. That's a bluegill right there. That's a big one. Come on, buddy. That's a solid, solid little bluegill. First cast, success. Let's see if you can like get a bass, if there's bass even in here. Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> finally. Is that a bass? Oh, look at that. There are bass in here. Well, that's a pleasant surprise.
Nice little healthy one too. He, he has some meat on him. Time for the release. Oh, just jumped right there. Let's see if we can get him real quick. Perfect, there's... I just hooked my kayak. What? How does... <laughs> How do they not get it? I do little trouble hooks on here. Hey! Another bass. We're making progress now. Now they're a little guy, but still they're all really healthy. They're ready. <clears throat> I think they left this spot. That's the hard thing actually fishing in like little ponds like this is after you catch them, they, they really do stop. I fished in like other friends' ponds where I've caught like three, three pound bass and I know there's more in there, but you'd catch, oh. There we go, another, another little guy. They seem to all be the same size. I'm sorry, buddy. Ouch. And boom. Oh yeah, come on. <laughs> come on, that, I saw that. Like these bluegill are literally like jumping out of the water and hitting it like bass, but no bass. Dang, that's another big one, like bluegill. All the bluegill I've caught have been like this, ooh, this size. And that's a pretty big bluegill. Like they, they have some meat on them, they really do. <sighs> Are you ready to calm down? And they all seem to be this aggressive and exciting. Oh man, splash water all over my lens. Well, I can get them in the GoPro. You can't, <laughs> yeah, see, that's super clear. Oh, he, no, there he goes. There's a bass. They, they like it really slow. guys thank you for watching <laughs> catching some monsters not really healthy fish though it was kind of cool neat little pond small bass big bluegill see you next time